I wasn't expecting you to get, go so soon, and I was so excited that you jumped right in with your icebreaker. First of all, I think it's great that you brought your family here. It's wonderful to have them here to support you. I think that's always cool to just bring a little bit of home in your life actually here with you. So I think that's great that you all came to support him. I love icebreakers like Christy. They're my favorite speeches because it's a really great chance for us to know, to get to know more about the speaker. This new member that we have, we're excited to have you and to get to know about your life a little bit is so much fun for us. And one of my favorite parts about icebreakers is when people pick a story, a significant story, something that says a lot about them in their life. And I think that you picked a great story to tell. It really let us know something unique about you, that you were great at wrestling, how you ended up being a teacher, going to Canada. And I think it was just a really something unique about you, something that we can remember in you. He wrestled, he taught, and he was a great wrestler. And I think that's a really cool thing to share with us. I was blown away at how great your speech was. For your first speech, it was fantastic. You had amazing eye contact, first of all. You just came up here and were so incredibly confident. It seemed like you've been telling stories forever. And it was so, it made me feel so much more comfortable to see how comfortable you were. And I think that that was really impressive. You used the word of the day right away, which I thought was really neat. It's hard to try to work that in. Usually when you give you know, speeches, when you start off giving speeches, you kind of have everything planned out and to work something like that in. Last minute is always really impressive. Also, we kind of had a distraction over here that was, got really noisy and uh, had ended up closing the door for you, but you handled that really well, I thought. You kept going, you weren't, you didn't, it, you didn't let it take away from what, from your moment and from what you're trying to say. So that's really impressive too. That's always hard for people who are nervous and just kind of up here to not be distracted by something like that. And it was really loud, so I was really impressed by that. Again, I thought you, you're just a great storyteller in, in general. You had great interaction with us. You had good body language. You were excited and enthusiastic and into what you were saying, and I thought that was really cool because you should be. It's a story about yourself. So it was great that you were seemed really excited to tell it to us. A couple of things I noticed, just you kind of work on having your speech flow a little bit more, maybe some more drama, like dramatic pauses or voice, a little bit more voice flexion um, and tone, but that will just work itself into your speeches as you give more speeches. So really, other than that, I thought you did a great job bringing in humor to your speech. You made us all laugh. We were completely engaged with what you were saying. And I loved how, at the end, you brought, you brought your speech full circle. So you talked about how you just wanted to be known as Pete and being famous as you already were. And you had that back in the beginning of when you started talking about it in your introduction. So all in all, I thought you did a great job. It was a fantastic first speech, very impressive. And I'm very looking forward to 